Now we are going to start case study question number 34 and this case study question is based on uh, life process chapter related with blood vessels. The tubes, blood vessels, arteries, the topic is tubes, blood vessels. Arteries are the vessels which carry blood away from the heart to various organs. Okay of the body. Since the blood emerges from the heart under high pressure, the arteries have thick elastic walls, veins collect the blood from different organs and bring it back to the heart. Okay, this part. Arteries. They do not need thick walls because the blood is no longer under pressure. Instead, they have walls that ensure that the blood flows only in one direction. On reaching an organ or tissue, the artery divides into smaller and smaller vessels to bring the blood in contact with all the individual cells. The smallest vessels have walls which are one cell thick and are called capillaries. Exchange of material between the blood and surrounding cells takes place across this thin wall. The capillaries then join together to form veins that convey the blood away from the organ or tissue. Now based on this context, some questions are there. We will start with the first question. A blood vessel which carries blood back to the uh, heart is? Vein. Vein. Very good. Next, the blood vessels which carries oxygenated blood from the lungs to the heart is main artery, pulmonary artery, main vein or pulmonary uh, vein. Pulmonary vein. Very good. The correct answer is that one only. The smaller vessels in which arteries are divided after entering the blood organs are called cytokinesis, granum, centrioles or arterioles. Centrioles? No, no, no. The last one, arterioles. Next, after entering into the tissues, the arteries are divided into aorta, atrium, capillaries and veins. Atrium? No, no, no. no. Context mein tha wo. Capillaries. That is capillaries. Next, the blood vessels in which there are no walls includes first veins and capillaries, capillaries and arteries, arteries and nerves, veins and arteries. Correct answer is capillaries and arteries. So this is the last question of this case study question. So we'll see the next case study question in the next one. So thank you.